This is what we're going to be making today. You can find all the scripts in the description below for free, just copy and paste. First thing, you want to create a player melee script. It's going to have three variables, attack origin, attack radius, and enemy mask. If you don't know how to create an enemy mask, this is how you do it. Go to layers, edit layers, type in enemy in the first free slot, and then select your enemy, and then attach the enemy layer. Okay. Next up, in the on draw gizmos, we want to draw a wire sphere at the attack origin position with the attack radius. Our code looks like this so far. And now in the Unity editor, you want to create an empty game object on your player. Call it a damage zone or whatever you like. And now just move it in front of your player. Next, select your player and then click and drag the damage zone into the attack origin. And then select the enemy mask that we just created. You should now be able to uh, change the radius and visualize the damage zone. All right, back to our code. We're going to add a new variable, attack damage. In the update method, we're going to check if we press the K key. If we did, then we're going to get all the enemies within the range. We're going to cycle through all the enemies and deal damage to them. If you don't have a health manager script, don't worry. Here's a simple implementation for you. This is from my other video, which I highly recommend you check out for more details. This code is going to work perfectly fine, but the problem is that the player can spam the K key. So we're going to add two new variables, cooldown time and cooldown timer. Then we're going to check if the cooldown timer is less than or equal to zero. If it is, then we're going to reset the cooldown timer. Otherwise, we're going to decrease the cooldown timer. And that's it, our code is complete. Now we can make it juicier. First, we can add some animations. Then we can add some camera shake, blood particles, a little bit of knockback, and some sound effects. And that's it.